in today's day when biology indeed science is becoming more and more integrative we have to step beyond disciplinary boundaries of saying oh i am trained in physics i am trained in biology or i am a biochemist i am a molecular biologist or i am an evolutionary biologist and one needs to be in a frame of mind where one says okay this is my question and i am going to pick up and use all kinds of tools that are relevant to addressing this question whether those tools come from mathematics or from molecular biology or from computer simulation or experiment or anything so we're right in the middle of the monsoon school now and as you can see it's raining behind me the monsoon school this is the fourth year we're running it and the idea really started when we realized that students from physics and computer science and chemistry weren't really choosing to work on biology not because it was not interesting but because they'd never heard about it problem is in school you learn biology in the 10th standard and then you stop and so our idea was just to bring these students to our campus and expose them to all kinds of biology it's a huge amount of information in a short span of uh, 10 days or 2 weeks this is the fourth year that we are running this uh, ncbs uh, simons monsoon school it started in 2013 uh, it was started by my colleagues mukund tate sandeep krishna madan rao shachi and madhu venkatesan at that time and the number of applications this year we got about 250 uh from uh again these various backgrounds and uh, we go through a rather simple selection procedure after which we get about 40 students to come uh to the program but their backgrounds this year have been uh quite varied about 20% of them are studying biology and uh, the rest is a fair mix of uh, physics and math and we also have a couple of students studying computer science So this uh, school was extremely helpful for me because I have actually now got to know of uh, different areas uh, and uh, uh, basically different streams which are uh, coinciding with biology to come out with uh, amazing research that is going on everywhere which is actually helping uh, biology come out as a different field so I'm really glad to be here So the monsoon school consists of really three different portions. One are pedagogical lectures that is we give lectures on advanced topics in mathematics, physics, biophysics and so on. Then there's also the so-called research talks where we invite colleagues from NCBS and other institutes around Bangalore to talk about their own research, real biological questions, the experiments they are doing. And these are at a very high level. Finally what we have are hands-on sessions which we call tutorials. Now these are not uh, experimental tutorials because those are much more difficult to put together. These tutorials uh we get the students to actually use the mathematical tools we've trained them on and apply them to questions that they've come up with uh during the course of the monsoon school the idea behind this uh school is really to give the students a window to look at biology in a slightly more interesting way uh from the perspectives of their training in in physics and math and computer science the monsoon school is a really great way for the undergraduate students to get a feel for the kind of research that we do here at NCBS Uh, and especially for those who are working in mathematics, physics or computer science to really understand what their role for these kind of researches are in modern uh, interdisciplinary biology. I've never been exposed to all this other fields of biophysics and now like I have so many people who I can contact if I have ideas. So in that way this this monsoon school has been very good for me. And apart from that uh, the conversations that we had it it each conversation that we had i get like five different ideas from this the profs over here like we used to sit for lunch together and we used to discuss stuff like open end problems were given to us and uh, interactive sessions were there so profs are really nice and it was an awesome experience so i think one of the most important ingredients of the monsoon school is the idea of student projects what we do is on the very first day we ask the students to break up into groups of about 4 or 5 and we try and mix people between different institutions and we ask them to brainstorm and think about defining an open question it doesn't matter if somebody else has solved it before the idea is just for them to be creative and come up with something new. best thing about the school is uh, like i got to know that doesn't matter like from which stream i am from i can apply my skill to any of this interesting biology problems so a lots of uh, problems active problems are in this school 
so i can like join and explore this field uh, that's the best thing i uh, which i got here and the other things are like i got to know um, like a uh, lots of people from different background different uh, colleges uh, from all over the india so i uh, had a really good experience here so coming to this ncbs like it opened a whole range of new questions to me so that was very interesting i also uh, enjoyed the fresh approach that these people had to uh, biology even though many of them came from maths and computer science and physics i found that very inspirational in a way because we weren't tackled to uh, manage normal problems i mean we usually had to say okay a biologist tackles biological problems but before i didn't have this will or I'd rather didn't have the courage to uh, think about other problems the flavor of interdisciplinarity is absolutely uh, running through every aspect of what we do in this school and when they go away that's when all the thinking starts again and eventually they realize that this biology subject might actually be something they wanted to work on and in fact this has worked because over the 4 years that we've been running it many of the students in the monsoon school have actually come back and joined our phd program every year many students like me from backgrounds other than biology have been taking up research in biology and i think that the monsoon school has played a huge role in this so i am very thankful to the organizers being like organizing these type of things for like the undergraduates and all so that we can do some things we have the scope to do the things so there is like much a uh, wider field than a uh, just a biology or just a physics there is like many interdisciplinary things and it's already uh, a success if they take away from the school uh, that they can bring something from their training to address uh, interesting problems in this uh, very open field so in my opinion those of us who are biologists and who have a feel for the system we also need to educate ourselves even if it was not part of our background so that we can also work in the theoretical side of things ourselves where we bring our understanding to bear and for those who come into theoretical biology from a background in physics or mathematics they need to educate themselves about the biology before they can actually meaningfully contribute so it's really important to to sort of break these disciplinary barriers and apply oneself much more holistically to whatever question one is trying to address